Hello, hello, hello. I'm going to give everyone a moment to get in here. Um, this is going to be a very, very quick live. Uh, I hope all of you are doing well. And I'm glad, you know, we had a number of people who inquired about the last live, uh, which is on the YouTube channel. Hello, C Simplicity. Uh, it is on the the YouTube channel uh, for if you missed the last live that we did but this is a very quick message uh, hello B underscore Lou 81 I hope y'all are doing well our trip to uh, Rio de Janeiro for the world's largest carnival happens in February of next year okay so get into this if you have ever wanted to join uh, a, a travel experience or if you've ever wanted to visit Rio uh, Brazil we really are the best people to uh, travel with to Brazil because we are the experts we've gone to Brazil for many many years our travelers are always safe we prioritize people's safety and you know if you pay attention to the news you know Brazil can be a little tricky to navigate at times with the the language barrier and also just with the general safety concerns and so for many years hi the creator core uh, for many years we've kept people safe uh, in this amazing beautiful travel experience that is both relevant to the fact that it's the carnival season and giving people the rare opportunity to appear in the carnival parade and also just the simple fact that um, you know we want to make sure you have the cultural experience and understand the cultural significance that those of us of African descent um, the role we play in not just uh, the carnival but also in Brazilian culture I mean believe it or not even uh, the the work that we do here uh, as, as black Americans, we are influencing uh, Brazilian, Afro-Brazilian culture uh, as well with the movements we have and what we're doing uh, socially and entertainment wise. Like we really have a heavy influence uh, on uh, our Brazilian brothers and sisters and cousins and relatives. With that being said, February is when everything goes down. It is the time to be in Brazil, the time to be in Rio. Uh, with that being said, um, you know, registration has opened. So if you would like to understand how to be a part of the trip, definitely email us at Black Travelers Network at gmail.com. That's Black Travelers Network at gmail.com. Put in the subject headline, uh, Rio uh, 2024 or Rio Carnival. Put any one of those. You will get a response. We will get you the information regarding what it takes to join the travel experience. Uh, it's an um, amazing experience. We have great reviews. We just came back from a fantastic experience. And every year is different. Uh, like I said, that's the beauty of us having had the, the years and the history of doing this type of event in this specific city, in this specific country. Not any and everybody can do it. Um, we have the best of the best that we work with. I always tell people, and this is kind of like the purpose of the live, because I actually just got off of a, a call with uh, one of uh, the people who is actually about to register. Um, and her question was regarding, uh, you know, is there a lot of walking when it comes to the experience? And here's what I'll, I'll say. I always tell people, prepare to do walking. We are in Brazil. Part of feeling the energy and the vibe means you will, you will have to walk. You will have to be able to be mobile. With that being said, carnival is a come one, come all kind of vibe and kind of energy. So different people from all walks of life, from all angles of, you know, mobility, lack of mobility are a part of the festivities and the celebration and the overall experience. And just to reflect on some of what we've encountered over the years is 
we have encountered, you know, young people who ha may have just had surgery, um, who want to be a part of the experience. Uh, we had someone who broke their leg, who still wanted to come and, and be a part of the experience. And we even had, um, God bless him, one of our, our, our recent travelers, uh, an older gentleman who came on the experience and he you know, had some, some mobility issues due to a back injury. And so we've seen it from young people to older people who have these like restrictions in terms of their movement. What I ask of all of you who register and who come with us, please, 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 ladies and gentlemen, if you have any concern or any question about whether or not you will physically be able to keep up we need to know that in advance so we can plan accordingly. Um, we want you to make want to make sure that you know that you are a part of the group. You will be a part of the group, but we make special contingency plans and special uh, arrangements with uh, our team members to be able to make sure that anybody who has uh, a physical mobility issue, be it a broken leg or uh, a broken ankle, sprained ankle, whatever the case may be, if you're coming uh, and visiting and you have, maybe you just had a surgery like one of the other young ladies, I mean, but you still want to be a part of it because this experience happened only once a year. Um, we need to know that in advance. Uh, unfortunately, in the past, we've kind of found out, even though we ask in advance, we've kind of found out when people have arrived and that is not the time for us to find out. We want to make sure that one, you're not slowing down the bigger group. And not only are you not slowing down the bigger group, we want to make sure that you're able to get the full experience, even with your issues around mobility. And so I want to emphasize this because it's definitely worth me saying and uh, shout out to uh, the sister Tamika who I just got off the call with uh, who uh, is looking to register um, for this trip uh, you know we just need to know if you think you you may be operating or moving about at a slower pace we got you uh, you will be a part of the group but you we, we will make sure that you're not slowing the larger group uh, down because we have people in place to deal with that issue uh, for some of our travelers. So with that being said, that is the quick live message. Register today. I mean, it's like the peak season of Brazil. Uh, spaces tend to go relatively quickly, uh, depending. Uh, you don't want to wait till uh, we get closer because, you know, the costs can and will rise. And so uh, I say that to, to say to all of you, we welcome you. We look forward to traveling with you next year to Rio de Janeiro uh, for uh, the world's largest, grandest, greatest, most beautiful carnival. Uh, but it all starts with you registering today. So take the time, email us, blacktravelersnetwork at gmail.com to get the details on how you can join and be a part of this experience. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen.